Good morning, guys, and welcome to another review from me, Matt the Beta Bazakakaka. Hope you guys are well wherever you are in the world, whatever you're getting up to. Hope you guys are keeping safe and healthy. I have another review. This is almost kind of like a re review, this one. Um, I did review it when I kind of within the first year of me starting doing my Instagram and YouTube and everything. And I thought I'd do it again because I was so impressed with it. It was like, I'm going to do a re-review in case some of you guys have missed it, hadn't seen it or whatever, because it's way back. It's still on my channel, but it was way back when. So before I get started, I know I say this each and every single time, and you must be damn well sick of it by now. But a huge, huge, massive thank you for all the support that I'm getting over there on Instagram as Viking Beard Matt. Here on my Beard of Berserker YouTube channel where I'm trying my hardest to help promote these small brands, individuals as a fly, and craftsmen out there that are making some amazing, amazing products that we really need to get behind them, help them, support them and encourage them and give them a follow. As with all reviews that I do on my channel, links will be down below in that their description box. And so, yeah, so I need my glasses, got me notes here, forgot my mug of coffee, but oh well, there you have it. So this has been very kindly sent through from uh, Mad Viking Beard Company. Dun, dun, dun. Madvikingbeard.com, info at madvikingbeard.com. Like I say, I'll be putting links down below. This is the third review now that I've done for Mad Viking Beer Company. Um, this is their collaboration box um, with BLS, Black Label Society, which I'm a huge fan of, always have been. Um, remember as a kid going to watch Ozzy and stuff like that, and Black Label Society, I've seen them a couple of times. And the man himself, Zach Wild. Don't very much he'll watch this, um, but they bought out uh, basically a collaboration kit. You can buy the pieces individually or you can buy them in this box set. And it's kind of like a collaboration because the first debut album, I think it's over 20 years now, um, was called Sonic Brew from Black Label Society. And this was a collaboration box to commemorate that. Now, before I get started, there's a couple of codes for you guys out there in the US um, because these come through with the box. Um, but they're codes to get $10 or $100 off. And so if there's anyone out there that wants to use the codes, please feel free. Special gift for you, $100 wine voucher, claim within 30 days. Um, delivery included in the US, obviously not in the UK. But there you go. Um, there's the code there. Hopefully the camera will pick that up all right nakedwines.com does that mean you have to drink your wine naked no idea and all the gubbins and everything on the back but please feel free to use that another one i would have used had i been in the us but i'm not i'm in the uk um is for brutality coffee company um ten dollars brew car brew crew gift card that's a tongue twister try saying that um so there you go, there's a $10 Brew Crew gift card. How to spend it um, on the back, discount code and everything. So please feel free to use that if there is anybody out there that can make use of them. Because I can't, I'm in the UK, so there you go. So this is El Box itself. Black Label Society, SDMF, and made in the US. This is an artist series special. Produced and mixed by Mad Viking Beard Company, Mercenary Management, Black Label Society, Zach Wild, 1998, Zach Wild, all rights re reserved, duplication prohibited, distributed by Mad Viking LLC. Sonic Brew, premium quality beard kit, and really nice magnetic box. Um, I actually have two of these. Um, this is uh, the original one that I have I done the review of in the past. I have used the products that are in there and bless them, they have sent me through a new one which I'm keeping as pristine and not gonna use because it's such a beautiful kit. I love the products that are inside and with all the reviews that I do, I do try and test everything. So it's nice to have one that's just completely untouched which it has still in its case. So also with the box, 
got some really cool Mad Viking um, beard stickers. That's how I feel first thing in the morning. And you've got the Mad Viking Beard Company. Really, really nice stickers. And this one, which is really cool. This come with the new box. Love that one. That is awesome. Mad Viking Berserkers. And it's the same. I've, I've got stickers that I kind of like, I put up on me in my um, review room. There's some stickers that once you stick them up, you can't reuse them and stuff. So I do keep them all as nice. So opening the box. This is what you're presented with. Black Label Society. It's got the logo and everything in there. Inside the kit itself, you get a Black Label Society sticker. There's also the Mad Viking beard card as well in there. The kit itself comes with a bandana, which I, I have actually been wearing this one in uh, with the coronavirus thingy that's going on and getting strange looks off of people. I wear a kilt, so get I'm used to strange looks. So this is the bandana you get within the box itself. It actually smells of the beard oil. Um, really, really nice. Decent quality one, actually. Black labels are safe. Um, I'll wear that for you while I'm doing a review like some sort of demented old woman. There we go. Wife's giving me very strange looks and like, what the hell are you doing? Do I look fetching, honey? <laughs> so there we go. I'm now safe from coronavirus. What did I marry? I know, what did you marry, honey? So inside the box itself, apart from the bandana and the stickers, this is what you actually get and it's so well put together. Inside you get oh, we had scarfs coming down. Put that down there. Inside you get the Black Label Society Sonic Brew Premium Quality Beard Soap, four and a half ounces of, uh, produced and mixed by Man Viking. Uh, ingredients: olive oil, water, coconut oil, sodium hydroxide, organic palm oil, shea butter, or shea butter, whatever you want to call it. Activated charcoal, castor oil, organic aloe. Bentonite clay and kaolin clay, leather, ginger root, redwood and cedarwood, and sandalwood and lemon essentials. That's the scent in it. And that's the big old block of soap that you get. This is the new one um, because I've actually used the old one, to be honest with you. And so I've sort of like pulled bits out of the kit that I haven't used so I can actually show you. Really, really good. Um, Beard shampoo bar, beard soap bar, whatever you want to call it. Really, really nice. And the thing that I love about this whole kit and the collaboration is the scent. Uh, the scent profile of it is a light citrus with notes of ginger, uh, wood, uh, woody sort of scent to it, and a base note of leather. And this is such a really nice scent. It lasts for ages, really well put together. I was expecting being Zach Wild and... Black Label Society that it was going to be like a really heavy musky one but it's not it's really nice really good summery one as well also you get a limited edition Black Label Society beard comb so hopefully the camera's picking everything all right that up all right with bottle opener on it as well nice decent thick one as well with these horrible flimsy ones so that's nice it's very cool and getting on to the main reason you would go out and buy that, the kit. I'm just going to take these out for a second. Put the box on the floor. Give me a bit of room. Also inside, you get a custom printed guitar pick, um, beard balm scraper, however you want to use it. Mad Viking Beard Co. on the back. There's a fly buzzing around me and I'm doing my best to ignore it because as you notice with all my videos, there's no editing or anything like that. It's all done in one single take. So there you go, that's the pick you get in there. And the main crux of the kit, why you'd buy it, as well as it being Black Label Society, is the oil and the beard balm. Oil itself comes in two ounce bottle, and I believe as well, yep, the beard balm is a two ounce tin as well. Really nice to see something different out there. Sonic Brew Premium Quality Beard Oil. Ingredients wise, in the oil, you've got sweet almond oil, 
apricot kernel oil, virgin argan oil, jojoba oil if you're common like me or if you're posh, jojoba oil. Also got avocado oil, hemp seed oil, grape seed oil and vitamin E oil. And the nice thing with the kit as well is there was a nice decent layer of foam in there as well. So everything was nice and protected. Arrived in around just over a week from the US, which is not bad with all the coronavirus and everything that's going on at the moment. Medium viscosity sort of oil. Um, nice rubber pipette on the top. Beautiful bottle, uh, matte black skull. Pale yellow liquid. And I do have a scale for how my beer products smell. Down here, very subtle, medium. Rip your head off and kick it into next year. This sits just slightly over that medium mark. It's not all the way up, but it's just over that medium. Really, really nice, light, refreshing, citrusy, gingery, leather notes. And everything they say on the description is exactly what you can smell in there. Initially, you get that sort of hit of the lemon and citrus, but there is really nice base notes of wood and leather in there with a light gingerness coming through. Really, really nice. I'm not putting it on the beer because, believe it or not, I haven't done my beer this morning. It doesn't look like it. Beer coming. I just want to have a beer come that actually goes through your beard and doesn't snag and pull your hairs out so really really nice oil scent wise is lasting for around about three to four hours before i can no longer smell it but the other half has said that she can still smell it so that's pretty cool and i say the bottle on that absolutely phenomenal really really nice and moving on as one cow said to the other you have the sonic brew black label society my hands are greasy and i can't get the sleeve off of it now go tin comes in a two ounce tin ingredients wise again sweet almond oil apricot kernel oil virgin argan oil uh, pumpkin seed oil jojoba or jojoba oil avocado oil hemp seed oil grapeseed oil your vitamin e oil shea butter shea butter however you want to pronounce it cocoa butter and beeswax so a lot of goodness going in there and uh, what does it say scent consists of ginger root redwood Sandalwood and leather sonic brew is mixed into an almond oil, apricot kernel, blah 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 blah. Um, apply a pea sized amount to the palm of your hands, rub your hands together, make sure that it's evenly coated, balm on your hands and fingers, massage the balm into the skin, then work out to the end of the hair, brush as desired, and blow dry on cool if needed. <coughs> Excuse me, my throat is still playing up. Uh, produced and mixed by, so yeah, really, really nice metal uh, tin. Let's see, I've used it and tried it. And it's not always nice to see um, with the scents from oils to balms that there is a cohesiveness between them. There's nothing worse than going out and buying an oil and a balm, they smell completely different, which has happened before. It's almost kind of like a limeade, lemonade with sort of scent to it. Really refreshing scents. Good for the old ink as well. So put that on there. I always get dry elbows for some reason. Um, so absolutely fantastic kit. It's beautifully packaged. The customer service uh, with Mad Viking Beard Company is absolutely phenomenal as well. And this is the first time I've actually come across something like this, which is a complete sort of beard kit, especially with one of my favourite bands and guitarists out there as well, which hopefully, fingers crossed, I get the chance to go and see in, I think it's November, depending on the coronavirus and thing, um, hopefully go and see them in Northampton, me and the missus. Um, is it Northampton? No, it's Nottingham, isn't it? Yeah, Nottingham, I think, 8th of November, something like that. So hopefully go and see them then. Um, absolutely amazing kit, really well put together, well thought out as well. There's not one part of the kit that lifts the other down, if you know what I mean. Everything's sort of like meticulously made, and I suppose it has to be when you've got Zach, uh, Zach Wilde 
sort of helping to create it and the band members and everything so everything is literally spot on and whether you use it keep it as a collector's piece you buy it as a fan of the band you buy it because of your beers and everything like i say you can buy them individually and the soap as well so you don't have to go out and fork out the money for the whole kit. Kit itself is a hundred United States dollars, which I forgot to actually check up on my currency converter before I started. So I'm gonna wait. I've just given my wife that look of can you please type can in? You check? Can you please my check in? A hundred USD in two pounds. It's probably gonna work out around about eighty to ninety odd quid, give or take. Mm -hmm. Well, according to today, today? £79.69. Pence. Yeah. £79.69. £79.69. Yeah. £79.69. Pence, which is pretty damn cool as well, because like I say, you're getting the beard comb, you're getting the box, the stickers, you're also getting the bandana as well, your guitar pick, the soap, big bottle of oil. Big bottle of, uh, big bottle, big tin, which you can use afterwards for keeping bits and pieces in. So really, really nice. And this is one of my favorite things I've actually ever reviewed on this channel. Like I say, a huge fan of Zach Wild and Black Label and Mad Viking. Tried a few of their other products as well, the Molnir stuff. All of their stuff is fantastic. And when it comes to scoring them out of 40, I'm scoring this complete 40 out of 40 it's absolutely fantastic stuff thank you for the vouchers as well um i know i can't use them but thank you nice little touch putting those in there absolutely fantastic kit i hope you've enjoyed this little review but before we go uh, not tomorrow i have a review tomorrow for something different but sunday i'm doing a beard product review and the reason I've said this, I don't usually kind of say what reviews I'm doing. Um, but on Sunday, I'm doing a beard product review. And this has to be, the one that I'm doing on Sunday has to be in my top three um, beard products that I've ever tried and tested. And believe me, I've tried a lot. Um, absolutely stunning stuff. It's a real game changer. So join me on Sunday morning for that one, UK time. But wherever you are, guys, whatever you're getting up to, whatever you're doing, keep on taking care of each other. Keep on helping, supporting each other. Stay safe. And above all, keep on loving each other because you only live once. Make the most of it. I'm still undergoing blood tests and everything else for this lump that I've got in my throat. God knows what it is. Don't really care. So I'm just living life to the maximum, which is why I'm wearing my guilt today. Have a great one, guys. Safe weekend to you all. Thank you so much. Love to everyone. Have a good one. Thank you.